it's here, the Xbox One, the Xbox Series X. So it's time to unbox it. I should just check, it says, power your dreams. It appears to power such dreams, we need to take off two. Yeah. I guess now we have to do another one. Okay. It makes sense that they would have multiple of these on a four hundred and fifty pound games console. Oh, we're meant to do it the other way. Okay, so we have it the right way around. And there it is. Look at that. Let's just unwrap it a sec. So it does feel a little bit premium. Oh god, I like I'm sorry. So it does feel a little bit premium in the, the way that we can put it in the wrapper. We'll come back to it when we've got it open. And here it is. It's a hefty piece of kit. Really hefty. The lights on it. Well, not lights on it. So you can see like the green effect that everybody goes on about. I'm primarily a PlayStation game, but on your press that, it's it's. Pr I'm not a Tampa Bay Buccaneer fan. If you're American, um, it's. It's, uh, yeah, um, pretty sleek. Obviously, you got the. Jesus, how difficult this is so hard. But you got the bottom bit base there, which is what it's going to go on here. So I'm just going to uh, check the rest of the box. I have my phone in the case, so it's talk to me a little bit of time. Right, so here's the rest of the box, I believe. So, yeah, so, we've got power, we've got the HDMI, and then we've got probably the most important bit to any console in here. There is the Xbox Series X controller. I don't play a huge, or haven't previously played a huge amount of Xbox. I do have the other controller. The D-pad looks cool and nifty. I like the feel. I like the, the grips. I hear that DualSense is probably the one to go with PlayStation this year. Oh god. Um, but uh, yeah. So. I don't know. It's telling me about the mics and I'm just messing about with the thing as well. I will make better videos in the future. I promise, but there we go, there we have it. Let's put in the batteries, put it in its place, and I'll show you show you in a minute. Ask about the size of these new consoles. Um, this is the Xbox where the PS5 is gonna go. But just to add a bit of perspective, I've only got PlayStations here, but here's the PS2. It's about as tall, but that, uh, I mean, I mean, that's, I don't know, this is a, the original PS4. Shorter, thinner. It's a big boy. And we all hear how big the PlayStation is. Okay, just because I know people care. Um, not so much to wear in the plug socket this time. You've got the storage expansion, which is actually just really cool and probably built better than the PlayStation, from my understanding. You got the two USBs, you got the Ethernet, but there's only one HDMI. I seem to recall on the Xbox, there was two. Um, yeah, also putting on the light makes a much better light for everything. So, uh, but yeah, that is. Works. Rest of the gaming center. There's a PS4. There's a PSVR, and that's where the PlayStation 5 will go. PS2, PS3, PS4. Um, they're all redundant. 
Oh, yes, for sure. Yeah, see, look, that's a green effect. Oh my god. Oh my god. Not going to see it much from where it is for me, but it's really cool. Uh, let's get plugged in and on then. So we're now on the right channel. I guess it's time. And that is the unboxing of the Xbox Series X. Um, there's many things to do. Set up the controller, that sort of thing, I guess. Uh, but yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. And uh, if I can stream something of it maybe later, I will. But until then, peace out. See you on the 19th with PlayStation 1.